Good morning. Um, it's just gone seven o'clock in the morning and I have been asked to record myself using the Do Not Age NAD test kit. So here we go. Uh, so it's important to note as I open it that it is taken first thing in the morning. Let's have a look what we've got here. Instructions. This is uh, where you put the blood. And addressed envelope. And then we have these two packages here. Alcohol prep pads. Some gauze. Two plasters or band-aids, depending where you're from. A glove for those that want to use it. We have two lancets to pierce the skin and get the blood. And then we have the NAD fixing buffer. This is where the magic happens. Instructions. Wash hands with warm water and soap. Well, good start. Okay, back in a moment. Hands are washed with warm water and soap, then dried. I'm now told to use the alcohol prep pad to sterilize the fingertip of the middle finger on the non-dominant hand. This pad to sterilize this area of the middle finger of my left hand. Make sure your hands are below your heart. Okay, so down there on the table is fine. Twist the cap off the lancet. So there's the lancet. Twist that off, it's nice and easy. And place the tip against the side of your fingertip. So I'm gonna go from here. Everybody can see that. Push down until you hear a click and feel a pinch. Okay, so here's the, here's the filter paper. And the blood is now forming, albeit slowly. <sighs> Pick up the filter paper and allow the blood to drop onto the first circle. It may take more than one drop of blood to fill each circle. Okay. Ah, there's the first drop. It's not quite filled. I don't know if you can see that, but it's not quite filled it up. So we're going to go for another drop. There we go. Um, okay, so that's the second one filled. I don't know if you can see that. Then we... Fill all the circles except the middle one. So we're going to skip the middle one out. I'm going to give my finger a little massage to see if we can get some more blood. What's next? Apply the gauze to the fingertip until the bleeding stops. And then apply plaster to fingertip. Okay. There we go. Excellent, next. Your blood spots should be kicked away from sunlight and heat and be left to air dry for two hours. Okay. Um, I've got the blinds drawn here so there'll be no direct sunlight onto it. Um, and it'll be left to air dry for two hours so I'll be coming back around 9 a.m. The next instruction says, after two hours, let two to three drops of NAD fixing buffer drop on top of each of the two spots marked fix. You may wear the glove if you wish, but the liquid is non-toxic. Okay, I will see you in two hours. Hi guys, back after two hours, feeling much more awake now, which is great. And as we can see, we have here... Uh, the blood is nice and dried. You can see it's gone through the back. So, the next part involves the magic source, the NAD fixing buffer. And all we do here, after two hours, let two or three drops of NAD fixing buffer drop on top of each of the two spots marked fix. So we put these on the ones that say fix. 
I think I put three on one of them then. Don't squeeze it too hard. That's my lesson for the day. Let the card dry for five minutes, then apply two to three more drops to the same spots on the reverse side. Okay, let's wait five minutes. On the reverse side now. What have we got here? So on the ones that says fix. Once this has dried, write your name in capital letters and the date on the blood spot card in the space provided. Okay, so we're all dry. Name, nice big capital letters here. Back, back to the instructions to see what's next. Place the blood spot into the resealable bag provided. Tear this, open it up like that, pop the card in. Ah, okay, then you have to seal this up. Then using the envelope that's provided, slide that in there. Uh, do we lick? Are we still licking things these days? I'm not sure. Use some tape if you don't want to lick it like I did. Um, once that's down, I will then take this to my local post office and send it via a tracked service. And then the final um, instruction is your results will come via email. So please make sure hello at do not age .org is on your email whitelist. If you don't know how to do that, just Google it, whether you're using Gmail or Hotmail or whatever um, email ser service that you use, there's a way to whitelist email addresses to make sure that when you get an email from them, they do come into your inbox and it does let you know that you've got one and it doesn't get moved to the junk or the spam. Uh, because obviously, if you're doing this, you're gonna wanna make sure you get your results. And that is the NAD test kit from Do Not Age. If you have any questions, Drop us an email on hello at do not age .org. Thank you.